the federal poverty level has been updated for 2018. Now, this is a number, a baseline established by the federal government, which is equivalent to the minimum amount of gross income a family needs, is determined to need for food, clothing, transportation, shelter, and other necessities. It's that baseline level of a measure of poverty. It varies based on family size and the amount of income a family is making. Now, it is adjusted annually to stay current with the Consumer Price Index. This year, there was a slight increase of 0.7%, not quite keeping up with the cost of living increase, but used, again, for a number of ways to determine eligibility for social programs. Now, the 2018 numbers have been released. They were published in the Federal Register on January 18th. The marketplace, when you're applying for health care coverage through healthcare.gov, will still be using last year's federal poverty level. So it's important to know that even though many people use the federal poverty level as released for current eligibility and federal benefit programs, if you are applying for healthcare.gov, you will be using last year's federal poverty no level numbers. Folks applying for Medicaid or Badger Plus here in the state of Wisconsin will be using the new 2018 numbers moving forward. We make it easy for you on our website. We share our federal poverty level calculator. You can input your household income, the number of people in your house, hit calculate, and it's going to let you know where you fall on that federal poverty level spectrum. We also, at the bottom of that page, include a link to the 2017 numbers if you are somebody applying for a special enrollment period in healthcare.gov in the federal marketplace. Thanks for joining us.